Hey, it's Adam with the Productivity Academy, and I've got a really cool tool I want to share with you today. I've just been using it uh, for a couple of weeks, but it's really powerful. So to demystify this, there are so many AI tools out there right now. I'm sure you've seen or heard a lot of these. Um, thanks for summarizing. Thanks for helping you write faster, come up with ideas. Um, so I've come across at least 100 of these over the past two years, and they're going to keep coming and getting just more and more interesting. So I say that because it's really interesting, I think, when one of these catches my eye. Uh, and one of these that I want to show you today is barely.ai. So I've got a uh, article pulled up. I'm going to move my face out of the way. Uh, in the background, uh, why you need a personal board of directors, I'll leave it up to you if you want to read that or not. But a lot of times coming across these articles, right, this isn't a huge long read, but I'm like, ah, I'm not sure if I want to dive into this or if it's an even longer article to get a gist of this, right? So that's where this really comes in. So I've got barely installed. And if I click on it, I can get uh, an executive summary and I'll go through some of the other things you can do here, but check this out. So pop it up, Barely's thinking, it's gonna go through and using that GPT-3 uh, function, it's gonna go in here, create a summary, give you a takeaway and then counter arguments. So it says this article discusses the concept of a personal board of directors and how it can be used to improve decision-making. That's great because, I mean, obviously we knew the first part, the title of the article was, why do you need a personal board of directors? But it's improving decision-making. Like, oh, okay, that's actually literally personally important to me. And I've already saved this to Readwise as our reader, as you can see up here. Um, which in another video, I want to share some of the advances in Reader and what they're also doing with GPT-3. It is really cool. Uh, but this is handy. So any site I'm on, I can pop this up. And then the key takeaways, right? Gives a couple and then some counter arguments. So overall, I highly recommend at least trying it out. Uh, there's a ton of other functions uh, that Barely can do. Um, they have uh, a paid version that does some longer form writing, but it, uh, you can use it to expand things, to summarize things. Uh, to give you writing prompts, to give you ideas. Uh, there's a whole lot. So highly suggest checking it out. Great tool, fun to use, easy to use. And if nothing else, I think just the executive summary for articles and uh, general web pages, other things you're browsing to help save you time is a huge win. So give it a shot.